Have you heard of the ancient Keyblade War? Huh? Of course I have. Long ago, Keyblade wielders waged a war over the ownership of light. Yeah, the Master's favorite story. I wonder what they planned on doing with Kingdom Hearts after... making it appear. Who knows? I don't get why anyone would initiate a war. So... You know the Lost Masters? Who? They're the ones who started the Keyblade War. Never heard of them. Where'd you hear about that? Or... They're the ones for whom... The war started. I'm not following you. You can drop the facade. Facade? On that land shall darkness prevail and light expire. A prospective Keyblade Master should know this. If you say so. The gazing eye sees the fate of the world. The future. It's already been written. Really? I'm not so sure about that. Besides, who's to say I can't change it? And maybe light will prevail. <laughs> Pretty confident. But things aren't in your favor. Perhaps, but unlike darkness, there is more light than meets the eye. You might be surprised. Oh, I hope so.
To defeat Xehanort, there are allies we must gather, acting now to rouse them from their slumber. We have discussed this before, Sora. Mm. Your mark of mastery exam was conducted in the hopes you would acquire the power to wake them. However, the darkness nearly took control of you, and your grasp of your new abilities leaves much to be desired. Oh. Furthermore, Xehanort nearly made you his vessel. 
and in the oh. process stripped you of most of the power you had gained by then. I suspect you have already noticed this, correct? But first, you must regain all the strength you have lost. Perhaps it is foolish to expect a complete recovery, but it is absolutely vital you perfect one power, the power of waking, which you failed to master during your exam. There's someone who lost his strength and found it again, a true hero to whom you ought to pay a visit. Perhaps he can point you in the right direction. Four? <laughs> Got it. Hmm. You can count on us to take care of Sora. I would have it no other way. I put Sora in your hands. And don't forget, we'll keep an eye on you. Oh, this is going to be lots of fun. It's not a vacation. <laughs> Let's go. Count on us. we supposed to get there now? What? I thought you knew. Looks like all the old highways are closed. Didn't Master Yen Sid say that Sora should trust the guidance his heart gives? Come on, Sora. Which way? Um... Hey, would you get serious? Give me a break. I'm trying. These things take time. <sighs> Well, since we've already been before, why don't you try picturing our friends like we're there? Hmm... Wow! Sorry, I got nothing. What did you expect? May your heart be your guiding key. Huh? What's that? Master Yen Sid always said that, right before we went off on any of our real important adventures. Really? Ring a bell? Uh -uh. Maybe I just imagined it. May my heart be my guiding key. <laughs> I got it! Right! Olympus Coliseum, here we come! At long last, the time had come. The planets were edging into perfect alignment. And the plan Hades devised 18 years ago was about to reach fruition. The fates had predicted this very future, the day he would seize control of Olympus and rule over all the cosmos. Hades' previous attempts, using Terra, Cloud, and Orin, to advance his plans for conquest, had failed. The hour was not yet right. But now the planets were aligned, and nothing could possibly go wrong. A wave of darkness slants down from their celestial rank, and one by one, Hades freed the Titans from their prison. Some of them, the same monstrosities that Sora and his friends had already fought and bested before. With both the Titans and his longing for vengeance against Zeus reinvigorated, Hades began his attack on Olympus.